Is feeding and fertilizing your nipple test really useful? Today I will do a test on seedlings for 10 months. Some will have uh, food and fertilizer and some don't and we will see how they evolved. So 10 months ago I received this small uh, three truncata by Mira and also some vitiae, lowland. So that's the golden peristome. So here is the unboxing. Nothing really fancy here, but I just want to show you the size they had when I received them. So they were uh, tiny, obviously. That was some small seedlings. And you see it's uh, best carnivorous plants, BCP. And we have the ID, etc. So um, let me show you now. And they were almost all the same size, almost. Because this one, for example, on this uh, the right one, the tall one, you see actually there is two plants. So the pictures are almost the same and this one is a little bit smaller. So I will take the two big one and uh, do the test with that. And I also had a few other uh, really tiny plants. So that's the Vichyai. Now let's see the Truncata by Mira. Again, it's a BCP. Uh, and they, they were looking good, actually. Let me show you. So, uh, BCP, Truncata by Mira, you have the number. Picture is great. The, I like the color, actually. The green, this deep green, looks good. This one is lighter, but again, picture size, uh, it's uh, decent. And this one is a little bit smaller, but overall, except this uh, right one that is uh, darker on leaves, it's almost all the same size. So that's going to be great to do the test. I reported them all. Uh, on the left, you have the regular plants. On the right, you have the plants that will not receive any fertilizer or uh, food. So, and they are really beside each other. There is no way uh, it could be influenced by uh, the temperature, the light. No, no. Everybody grow with the other carnivorous plants. And all the uh, test subjects, let's call that this way, will be closed to their siblings. So all those VCIs uh, are lowland. So as soon as I have the growth tent, they will be on the growth tent just to grow better. So now we only need to wait 10 months. So here is the VCI when I received them 10 months ago. And here is what they look like uh, on the growth tent. So this is the one that was uh, a little bit bigger. And clearly, that's a fast growing uh, seedling. Uh, this is the one that is fed. Uh, fed plus fertilizer, uh, the whole shaban. Uh, I will show you another one. This one also receives everything. And uh, okay, you can see the color of the leaves. Uh, it was a little bit too much, too powerful, but everything is healthy. The pictures are good, but they are not that tall uh, compared to the other one. And then I will show you the one that didn't receive any food or fertilizer. Not bad, right? It's hard to tell if uh, food and fertilizer is useful or not. Uh, because it was also burned on the leaves, but uh, the pitcher is not that small when we compare that to a plant that was fed and fertilized. So now I will show you uh, the size. Uh, I want to show you really uh, properly the size of the pitchers. Let's uh, take this one. No food, no fertilizer. Decent size, right? Uh, everything is uh, formed properly and this is the one that is the fast growing plus fertilizer. A little bit bigger, uh, but I'm not sure it's because of the food. Because again, the, this one is also fed and uh, maybe it's more squat. Maybe later I will see uh, this was a more squat pitcher. But uh, let's see the truncata now. So the truncata 10 months ago, everything was almost the same except the color of the leaves. And here is 
how they are on the windowsill. So this one is fed. Uh, you will see um, the size of the picture is okay. Uh, good uh, ratio between uh, the, the leaves, etc. I will show you the one that is not fed. Almost the same size. Maybe even slightly bigger uh, pictures, but could be just a coincidence. And al always a slightly pale color. And then I will show you the one that is fast growing, deeper green. Uh, this one is fed and you can tell the size of the leaves and uh, you can see the stem. It's way bigger. And even the pictures, they are robust for the less. Uh, Clearly, this one uh, is maybe what the, the two other one will be in two months. But again, if I compare this fast growing one fed plus this one that is also fed, uh, it's hard to see if feeding is useful or uh, is just uh, uh, doing nothing, literally. So uh, I will need to wait more uh, because uh, I, I'm not sure now. Uh, those two, one is fed, the other one is not. They look really similar. So we will need to continue the test to see if the one that is fed is able to grow really faster. As you see, uh, it's not really obvious at this stage. And uh, we have some uh, fast positive. For example, the fact that we have some uh, fast growing seedlings uh, they are growing fast, uh, no matter what. I'm sure if it was the plant that was not fed, it would still be uh, a little bit bigger. Uh, but uh, when we compare uh, two uh, small uh, plants uh, sp with the same speed, not the fast growing one, I don't see for now a big difference after 10 months. So I guess I will continue this test for 10 other months and then we will know. If you want to know how to feed your Nepantes, especially when they are small, here is a video for you. Uh, thank you for watching and until next time, happy growing!